here today and today we're gonna do a little bit of a prom look because it's almost prom season well it is prom season a lot of like prom proposals I've been seeing on Instagram so I'm like why not let's do a little bit of a prom look so people can get an idea of what they want for their prom so yeah let's just get started I don't know what I'm gonna call it like always don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to hit that notification button to be notified whenever I post videos and premiere of my beauty within video will be next Saturday and also wait until the end for news brand new update news and scheduling and stuff like that cuz we're gonna be we did our eyebrows con contour our foundation our concealers and just gonna go straight to the eyes so today we're gonna use the Kat Von D shade in light eye palette and this one is the straight straight this one comes with the green we're mostly going to use green a little bit of a brown color you know how much I love brown and we're gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills double-ended brush today so and we're gonna use also our little swatchy swatch so we can you know swatch colors and we don't have to wait until we to wash this all off so we're gonna do the first transition color and we're gonna use since I love browns we're gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills contour palette this palette could be used in different ways and my way is basically eyeshadows contouring bronzer whichever color so we're gonna use this light color for just a transition color right in the crease we're gonna do that and I already primed my eyelids with a little bit of concealer and set it with our setting powder so we are fine and we're gonna set this right here all over the crease to make it look a little bit cunty and copper what and just you know blend that shit out this is the key to having a lit as eye makeup look and it's just blended out makeup is whatever the fuck you want it to be so all I want to do is put this on up here so it can be a good transitioning color and then I'm going to grab my Mel Cosmetics little palette and we're going to grab a little bit of this brownish color which is on the scene and we're going to put it right here right on the corner of your lid and then drag it because we need to make that eye crease really lit just blend it there now these colors are for mainly if you have like a black dress or a dark green dress this will look cute and we're gonna grab go back to this little palette right here and basically we're gonna try to clean this little tiny brush as much as we can 
because we're gonna grab that green look right there that we have where's that green we're gonna get this green and we're gonna pack it on our lid and just like that we're gonna pack it And don't worry because you still got to blend this shit out. And green is like black. So having a little bit goes a very long way. So remember that all the time. So yeah, it looks a little bit ratchet. So because you know we still haven't finished. We're going to grab this, the unseen brown look. Dust it off. And we're going to blend in these two colors completely so it could look a little bit you know flawless or whatever and we're just gonna blend until you know you kind of will know when the look will come together so like i said just keep blending and blending and blending it will come out lit as fuck so i will be right back look something like this like I said dark color or you can wear like if you're wearing a white dress this could be a look because you know everything goes with white but I don't recommend white for a prom dress because you're gonna be dancing there's gonna be drinks and most definitely there's gonna be a lot of spillage like a lot of spill so my recommendation don't wear white even though i don't i hate wearing white but now we're gonna go and grab chipper it's like a little highlighter type of eyeshadow from ColourPop. and what i'm gonna do i'm gonna pop it right at the corner of the eye so it can shimmer because you know you won't go wrong without shimmer and we're gonna put it also on top of the lid i'm trying to get a finger that's not really dirty and we're gonna put it on top of the eyelid right here so you can shimmer at night time and what you can do is grab a brush and just fucking blend the shit like that's all you have to do is blend blend until you can't blend anymore so you can blend these colors together and this color together Ooh, it looks cute let me go get another brush so we can get one of these brushes right here and we're just gonna blend this right here but we still won't have to blend this right here oh I just had ginger ale, so. Ooh, yes, you won't have that glitter on your eye. But we're gonna put more highlighter later on. And what you can do now is just put your contour, your bronzer, your highlighting, whatever you wanna do onto your face. So for the eyes, the under eyes, we're gonna use that same unseen color and we're gonna grab an angle brush. And we're just gonna do a little line under the waterline and we're going to blend that shit in so we'll make that little line down there like angle brushes are like the best if you're like a first time person With makeup like yes so then after that we're just gonna grab our little blending brush and 
gonna pour some of that color and and I'll box it and then I, I get a little bit of green just dab it just a little bit dab mix with a little bit of dab of the color and Ooh. And we're gonna do that smudge it like this. It's like a grudge effect. And we're gonna do that to the other eye. The last thing is to get our Marc Jacobs eyeliner and I poked my eyes, so that's why it's red. And just put it on the waterline. I did a little bit of a smoother little highlighter we use the chipper eyeshadow to just highlight and a little bit of blush and for lips what we going to do is I'm thinking of like a neutral pinkish like same of lip color of yours so we're gonna use the Marc Jacobs color and kiss kiss bam bam and this is a little sample that I had. Moisturized lips. And. It's pinker than I thought. So. What we're going to do is grab our Anastasia Beverly Hills. And undress. And we're just going to, you know. A little bit lighter. Like a natural lip color. Lip color and natural lip color. Or we can use the cut the brown color from Color pop, which is Hollywood Boulevard, but this could look, work a little bit. So I switched to the brown color, and I'm liking more the brown color. This is the one from Color Pop, Hollywood Boulevard. I'm kind of feeling it a little bit because you know, uh, you can see a little bit of the brown, so it matches a little bit more. This is like a Zara type of, you know, vibe. If you want light, then I'm posting a video with light colors if you want. Um, yeah. But, setting spray, rose water, already done. A little bit of mascara. If you want lashes, you can wear lashes. I don't prefer to wear lashes. I love my own lashes. And yeah, so this is the look. I hope you enjoy, guys. Give a thumbs up if you like. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification button so you'll be notified and enlighten of the new if you already finished watching this video. I'm going to be changing the days because I'm always busy and I can't be 100% on social media sometimes. So I'm changing it to Tuesdays and Saturdays. Time will vary from 3 to 5 o'clock eastern time so yeah so it could be a little bit more easy for me and i can interact with you guys in twitter tumblr and instagram everything will be in the description below you can also interact with me on my snapchat will that be in the description below also or in the screen so yeah i hope you enjoy guys now it's me time to go eat pizza so deuces